Now, that's one of the things that we've found out since we've been at the cotton company is many people, when they have guests or relatives coming into town or they just want to show off the town a little bit, anywhere in this whole Research Triangle Park area, that they come over to the cotton company and people like it because it's uniquely different. And I should tell you, we were the, one of the top ten uh, the Cotton Company is one of the top ten shopping destinations in the whole central area of North Carolina with Southern Living, Southern Accent Magazine. And one of the reasons we think so is people come in and they want to have something that's local. Example here is we carry a whole line of different books that are actually different events and sites. And I have a great deal of uh, care for this one right here. It's called Raleigh's Reynolds Coliseum. And if many of you don't know about it, prior to this actually to North Carolina State moving, this was where the most uh, people in the world had ever seen basketball games. It was Reynolds Coliseum. It was built, I think, somewhere about the 1950s, but it was like 12,000 capacity, and until they actually transferred the new team over several years ago, more people had seen college basketball at Raleigh's Reynolds Coliseum than is at North Carolina State. But you can see Wake Forest University. But what we try to do here, the Moravians who are up in Winston-Salem now, of course, if you come to North Carolina, we have auto racing and NASCAR stuff. And then, for those of you, this is a University of North Carolina basketball in the history. And, of course, who do they put at the top? Michael Jordan. But that's one of the nice things of the Cotton Company is you have a local flair. And we try to use local artists when we can. And, but we try to make sure that when you leave here, something that was different, that you can remember your experience of being here in Wake Forest.